Hi guys, this is Phil, uh, the Weekend Gamer. Um, so um, this is just a quick update on how to add uh, or manually add games to your uh, GOG 2.0. I think it's still in beta, so um, if you are running it, um, then this is how you're going to add manually add games. Now, you're probably wondering why would you want to manually add because, um, you know, most of the games on Steam or Epic or... Um, you know, um, uh, Origin or whatever. Well, um, not all uh, launchers are going to give you access to their um, platform. Uh, for example, Blizzard is one of those uh, uh, game companies that just doesn't offer uh, uh, outside view uh, from, um, you know, an API or, or some kind of thing. Anyway, so you click on Add, Manually Add Games. And then you're going to search for the game you're going to add. I know I'm going to add Diablo 2, so I'm going to type that in. And then uh, we're just going to, and it's going to, it fi finds the game. Highlight the game, uh, or the correct game. And then um, it's, uh, you see that link, it says link executable. Click on that, and then uh, you're going to find the, the game. So uh, I know where the, the drive is. It's probably in the D drive. And then um, we're just going to add that in. And then um, now, if you are going to play Diablo 2, you can launch it from your GOG library. Um, so that's actually really cool. Um, yeah, so you filter it uh, so you can see Diablo 1, which is on GOG, uh, Diablo 2, which is not available online anywhere, and then uh, Diablo 3, which is uh, on Blizzard. And those the latter two I had to manually add. So it's kind of nice uh, to um, to kind of have all this game in one place that way and keep track of how, how much time you're um, running or doing. Um, I'm just going to quickly test out the game. Uh, yeah, so it's launching uh, GOG, or it's launch, launching Diablo 2. Uh, as you can see from um, the terrible um, uh, 800 by 600 uh, pixel graphics. Uh, but anyway, yeah, so that's how you uh, add games to GOG or manually add games, uh, I should add. Um, so, um, yeah, thank you for watching.